what's up, Gemini? It's your girl, Isabella Tarot Tarot. Back at it again. Gonna hit you with your daily message. Thank you so much for all the likes, shares, subscribes, love donations. You guys are greatly appreciated. Anybody who, you know, um, supports this channel, I greatly appreciate you. Okay? Um, I'm not currently accepting personals in this time, but you're more than welcome to go over to my Etsy spiritual shop. That information will be listed in the description box below. Alright. Okay? Let's see what the energy is for you guys for today. What is the energy for the Gemini? What do they need to know? What do they need to be aware of? The energies around Gemini for today. Okay, we'll take the flipper. And just try to pop out, so we'll take it too. I keep like, okay, so. I started this video a minute ago. Alright, and I did get the tower card. And I was like, I don't want to do that as far as the energy. But it's clearly, there is a huge tower happening right now in this time for the energy for you guys. So there is going to be, a, it's kind of a little jarring, but it doesn't feel bad. It just feels like abrupt and fast, like a fast change happening. Um, an overnight change. For some of you, you're starting to see things happen overnight. Like I feel like there's something um, that's going to definitely catch your attention, catch the eye. Okay, for some of you, I'm hearing eye sore. Um, for some of you, you need to be getting your eyes checked in this time, okay? Lady of Lightning, surprises, sometimes shock, total paradigm shift. I'm telling you, it's like an overnight change has happened for you guys, okay? Or it's about to, uh, no, it's, it's not about, it's happening right now, okay? Um, I feel like you're starting to see things completely differently. I feel like for some of you, you might have done things half-assed, in a hurry to get something done. I don't feel like you're being rushed, but I feel like you're 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 doing something right in the in the right order or in the right way, following directions and doing something and I feel like it's also shifting things in this time for you because you're paying attention to the detail. Okay? This was the other one that came out. Small steps asking for help. The camel boy. Yeah. I feel like um, 33. There is some kind of huge thing happening right now. 33 is like um, spiritual enthusiasm. Okay. I feel like spiritual assistance, divine appointments. Okay. Ooh. For some of you, look, I, I got a random message that came in for those of you who were dealing with some kind of black magic where somebody was throwing shit at you. This shit is completely rerouting, all right? I feel like you might have asked for help in a certain situation or done something out of the norm, and I feel like there is going to be a huge shift observed in this time, okay? I feel like there's something I'm seeing hand out again like receiving open to receiving i feel like you're in the energy of being open to receiving open to getting open to um assistance in some way some kind of help all right there is it's like i feel like you have stayed in this wide-eyed energy like open to change open to suggestion okay no 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 let me let me rephrase that you were not open to suggestion <laughs> You were not open to suggestion or open to doing things differently, but I feel like there's something shifting in this time within you to where you are allowing um, someone to be of service to you. I feel like you were so used to putting in the service, putting in the work, you are actually changed. Things are changing um, in this time to where you are allowing someone to help you, and I feel like there is some kind of... Oh, for some of you, you had to go to God on a certain situation and God's coming in, stepping in and really changing shit overnight for you. I feel like it's like an energy shift. You're feeling that shit right now. Okay. Um, for some of you, like, I just really feel like you were just like kind of aimlessly walking in the desert is really what I'm saying. Like aimlessly walking. All right. Um, you didn't really know where to go but you just kept going forward i definitely see that there is some kind of visual there's something there's something happening right now okay um because of your persistence is really what i'm getting and i feel like you may have called someone to act on your behalf or to help in a certain situation and i feel like you called on a big dog okay like i definitely feel like you have called in someone who is more than capable of helping you if this wasn't you going to god like i feel like for some of you you're very um spiritual Okay, but I feel like you have gone to someone maybe a little bit more advanced or someone who knows a little bit more about a certain topic. And I feel like they're coming in and really 
um, fucking shit up in a good way for you, okay? Okay, like I definitely feel like somebody's coming in almost in a, like a protection mode for you. I feel like you might have been getting fucked over um, because somebody felt like they knew more than you. Or that, like I feel like an older energy. Some, somehow that they felt like they had more experience than you or you needed to follow them. Or they wanted to manipulate you in some type of way because you see the world almost like through a child's eyes. Um, Rose-colored glasses. I feel like you're no longer looking at the world like that. I feel like you, your eyes have definitely been open to certain situations. I feel like you are just having blind faith in a certain situation, though. For those of you who have called on God, blind faith, okay? God's coming through in a big way right now. Um, you're about to see some kind of major shift happen because you have called out for help. You've decided not to keep doing things yourself, okay? I feel like you have definitely allowed, like you've released the need to do. And now you're in the energy of just being, okay? But I feel like you're you're releasing the need to control some a certain situation. And it's all like unfolding for you in an effortless way, all right? For those of you who were manifesting, I see something coming through like almost immediately. It's almost like everything that was held back from you, whatever um, wasn't moving, it's just like happening, materializing overnight. And you almost like, you're like, how the hell is this even happening, okay? The Spirit Whisperer, Divine Guidance higher knowing i'm telling you you have definitely gotten smart in the situation i feel like you have gone to someone outside of yourself realizing that um you can't do everything alone or you can't do everything yourself or you actually need assistance in something okay i feel like you've definitely communicated with the right one okay um and i definitely feel like things are definitely happening and they're happening fast I really feel like it's more so in your favor to where all you, like, it's almost like a parent taking the wheel of the car and you just sitting in the back seat getting chauffeured at this point. That's really what I feel like. Um, all you had to do, like, they, they were, somebody was sitting there wanting, wanting you to ask for help. Um, whisper, the spirit whisper. I feel like you didn't want anyone to know that you needed help or that, you know, um, I feel like you didn't want to ask for help you really didn't want to ask for help but I feel like you know you are there's something of a softening of your ego that's happening right now there's some kind of softening of the ego to where it, you're realizing it's okay to not be able to do everything yourself it's okay to ask for help all right you really didn't want to do that shit you did not want to do that shit it's like I, I feel like the way that you you've humbled yourself a lot to um, reach out to a certain individual to ask for help. And it's like this person, whoever this is that you've reached out to, whether this is a physical person or literally the divine, um, I'm definitely feeling they are, they've been waiting on you. And they are so happy to come and help. It's like, I feel like that's why the shit's going to start going through immediately. The second that you ask so that you know that you can always go to this person for assistance. I feel like you have done the right thing is really what I'm getting. It's like this person's been wanting to assist you, but has been waiting for you to say something. Okay? Like, they're so happy. Like, I feel like somebody's been wanting to come to your aid. Alright? I feel like they knew that some shit was going on. And all you had to do was humble yourself and say something. All you had to do was say something. Okay. All right. What else does Gemini need to know in this time? The Ice Queen. Ideas preserved, non-action, and entitlement. Yeah, I definitely feel like you're coming out of this energy. All right. You're definitely coming out of this energy of non-action. Okay. I feel like you're definitely moving forward in a situation. Or not necessarily that you're the one acting. I feel like you have been really in your head about a certain situation. Okay? I feel like you've been putting some... There's been something that you've been putting to the back of your mind, not wanting to act on. All right? The Phoenix. Resurrection. Surrender to change. You are surrendering to change. I don't feel like you are fighting the... You're, I heard fighting the system, okay? For some of you, that was affecting your health in some type of way. Fighting the system. Fighting your systems is what I'm getting. Your health, like, something about it was um, taking a toll on your health, all right? You're no longer in the energy of fighting. It's like you're taking the necessary actions instead of um, pushing something to the side. I feel like you were pushing certain things to the side and, comp like, not compartmentalizing compartmentalizing in a healthy way 
okay? But I feel like you're definitely, a lot of you are practitioners. A lot of you are practitioners. And I feel like the level of prayer, I feel like you are um, definitely pulling someone in to help you. I just feel like there's just a whole lot of change happening in your life. I'm seeing five, five, five. All right. What else does Gemini need to know in this time? We'll take this one. That was too many. Mm, I saw some mess though. I'm putting it back in. Mm, change. <laughs> Got pity party, reaper, and someone is down low. Why does that one keep coming out? Attachment issues. Okay. Mm, mm -hmm. Y'all. Somebody is waits on someone to go to sleep and then goes out and creeps. I'm definitely seeing that, but I don't necessarily see that as being your situation. Um, I feel like someone has been... There, there's a situation where somebody doesn't work and then somebody works. Okay? In a living situation. And when, like, when this person is going to sleep at night, this, like... Their partner is, like, creeping out. And it's like what's crazy is... They're creeping out and going out with people of the same, like, I don't, I don't necessarily feel like it's uh, going out with these people. I feel like this person is realizing that they prefer the same sex. Alright. I feel like in some way this is coming out. And I feel like somebody is like, they can't decide whether they're mad or sad. Pity party. Um, I feel like this person is going into a deep depression over this. Because of what is brought out. Okay. I feel like this is somebody from your past. Somebody that you may have known in the past. Or you might have had a past relationship with this, this person. I feel like they're no longer keeping this shit to themselves. I feel like, um, yeah. Somebody's having a party. Somebody's coming out. And then I feel like they're already in a relationship with someone. And, uh, yeah. This person is feels devastated because they're finding out about their individual. They're finding out about someone who um, they they wanted for themselves. It's like they saw marriage with this person, okay? It's somebody from their past. Um, they saw marriage or a future with this person. Meanwhile, the person was not happy with what they were, what they were um, in. Okay, I feel like we're just being nosy. I don't really feel like this is your situation. For some of you, it may be. Um, but for, like, I feel like for the lower vibing, you know, you know, do you, boo-boo, if, if, if this is your message, this is your message. Um, I definitely feel like this was, this is causing some kind of, it's igniting some kind of spark within you, even though you're not seeing, like, not seeing it right now for those of you who this is your situation, okay? Um, but I feel like this might be somebody that you know or somebody close to you. I feel like um, they were definitely in some kind of living situation. It's definitely being exposed in this time that they are with someone who is um, not actually attracted to them. But I feel like they've been keeping that shit on the low. They have not been telling anyone, okay? I feel like it's coming out in this time. Um, somebody's coming out of the closet, definitely seeing that, okay? And I, I see somebody feeling devastated and not knowing how to move forward, okay? I feel like it's, um, showing up as attachment issues as well. Why does the Gemini need to know this? <laughs> oh, they're warning you. They're warning you. For some of you, um, this is someone that you might have dealt with in the past or you might have um, had some kind of inkling. I feel like this person, like you may have focused more on work than this individual. I feel like you were supposed to get out of the situation completely before this, like all this shit came up. Like I feel like there's a lot of people talking about it, all right? Um, I feel like this is somebody that you might, you might have one, at one point in time thought was your count like a car uh not a karmic it is a karmic but i feel like it's someone who you might have seen a future with okay um i feel like you might have had an inkling or thought you had seen something at one time but you tried to make yourself not see it 
All right. This is either talking about you or somebody that you know. I feel like if this is not you, this is definitely someone who you've got, like, that you are having in your vicinity in some way. You know of this individual, okay? They're, they're finding out that their person is um, either bisexual or straight up gay. All right. Um, I, I, it feels more like straight up gay. All right. Um, I feel like they're devastated. They're humiliated, devastated, and, and like throwing themselves into a deep depression. Um, I feel like there is something that is going to be changing about the situation. There is a huge change that happens. Okay. For some of them, oh, somebody got burned by the situation. Okay. And I feel like it's like, like, a, uh, mm, I don't know if I can say that on here, but I mean, like, this is like a big burn. This is like, uh, this one's going, this, this is something that could possibly take you out. Okay. Um, I feel like somebody is incredibly devastated over some shit that has definitely come out with someone who has been sleeping around with same sex. Okay. Ooh, is that the, is that the tea girl? Is that the tea? Ooh, what else we got? What else we got? What does the Gemini need to know? Be on guard. Stand your ground. Do not let this person back in. You are on to bigger and better things. A new, ooh, a new, a new beginning. Six of Swords. I feel like Spirit is definitely telling you, for some of you, this is what you were walking away from. This is what you've got out of. Do not relive the cycle. Do not go back because you're going to be, you, like, the person that they're with. That, ooh, hold on. person that they're with is finding out about that in this time and they're trying to figure out how to get out of a situation i'm definitely seeing someone is having to relocate or to find a different living situation i don't necessarily feel like this was a marriage though i don't feel like he got to marriage i feel like they may claim that they're engaged um but it just feels like a live-in situation it doesn't feel like a straight-up marriage um i definitely feel like there's news coming out in this time i feel like this is coming out about somebody either that's around you or somebody that you might have possibly dealt with in the past and you're realizing you dodged a bullet okay i feel like you're being able to move out of this situation move forward with your life and i do see a new love partnership happening for you i feel like you're finally in this energy of just being able to chill relax sit back okay and it's like a shift of karma is happening for you all right i feel like you're being able to definitely look at the all this hard work that you've put in and i feel like you're in this energy of being incredibly thankful that you dodged this all right i feel like you're going to be shocked but i feel like there was some kind of i feel like i'm seeing high priestess card pop out in my head i feel like you had an inkling about this um but you didn't want to see it or you didn't want to think that it was true all right it's definitely getting exposed in this time and spirit is saying stand your ground because like this person may try to get back with you um you need to uh, protect yourself okay protect your health is really what i'm getting in this time um but i feel like the person that they are with is big mad about the situation and is thrown into a depression all right anyways that's a little that's a little toxic but spirit's just saying to guard yourself in this time all right that's y'all's message like share subscribe don't forget to like share subscribe because it gets me seen um and i will see you guys later bye